We'll caution and concern tonight in Fairmount Park after a brazen broad daylight attack along Kelly Drive. A woman assaulted and injured by a suspect who's still at large. His weapon of choice, a piece of wood. Action News reporter Brianna Smith has the latest on the investigation. Philadelphia police believe the suspect is in his 30s and they're still searching for him after he ran away from the scene. Meanwhile, we spoke to visitors on Kelly Drive today and they say they've always felt safe, but after this attack, they'll be more vigilant. Peaceful, pretty, and packed with people. That's how visitors describe Philadelphia's Kelly Drive. Many spent their Friday afternoon on the trail or sitting by the river. It's gorgeous. You know, uh, the trees are starting to bloom. Now some say they'll be extra cautious after a woman was assaulted on Thursday afternoon. Philadelphia police say a 29-year-old woman was approached by a man at Kelly Drive and Fountain Green Drive around 515. Detectives say the man asked for a lighter and then hit her in the face with a piece of wood. They say the suspect suspect ran away from the scene and the woman was treated at the hospital. I feel bad for the um, girl that got hit and I want them to catch that criminal. It's pretty surprising. I mean, it seems pretty like calm here. I wouldn't expect something like that. These visitors are also shocked at when it happened. During the daylight and it seems like the criminals are getting bolder and bolder. And so we have to look out for each other. And they would like to see more security. I just pray that there are more police uh, per patrol in this area to make sure like something like that doesn't happen. I'm hoping for a better Philadelphia and less violence. Again, Philadelphia police believe the suspect is in his 30s and he was wearing a brown and green coat and a brown beanie at the time. If you have any information about the incident or the suspect, contact police. Reporting outside police headquarters, Brianna Smith, Channel 6 Action News.